Breathe the dance. cooch! Breathe the cooch. cooch! What if I just wore see-through pants and just my dangling? and just, uh, uh, would that, would yeah. that be okay? Hose and grumble! Hose! Oh my god, and the new merch! Sorry, hose and cow. Oh. Hose and cow. <laughs> morning welcome back to the vlog oh my god wait I'm so sad my hair literally covers the two cutest parts of this sweater oh that is some bullshit that is some bullshit okay well I guess this will be a sweater that I really only wear when my hair is up oh that is that is devastating that is truly devastating um okay well anyways <laughs> welcome back to the vlog i am feeling a little feisty this morning i've been inspired to create a safe space today in the comments to talk a little shit because i feel as if i really focus on being positive for the most part and I think it's actually a positive thing if we as a community talk shit together and just have a little vent sesh. Like that feels like a positive thing. Please feel free to use the comments to talk a little shit about whatever's pissing you off today because I got I got a few things. I got a few things and they are all entirely unrelated. This definitely was initially inspired by being annoyed at myself for letting just like the always on criticism of the internet and just like overall not being able to like escape constant criticism on the internet and having a little spiral about it and letting it piss me off which normally I'm pretty good about it I've been on YouTube for 10 years so like I'm not new with this but I'm human and that kind of shit can piss me off and so yesterday I let myself get a little riled up and I'm here to talk shit to be like fuck I hate when I do that and I hate when I let that criticism actually bother me and affect my day. I also hate that we only get one episode of Game of Thrones every Sunday. I want the whole season. And I think to conclude my shit talking vent sesh, um, I also hate that cardio is really hard but you have to do it if you wanna be in shape. That shit pisses me off. So anyways, <laughs> love this start to the vlog for us. Again, please feel free to have a little vent sesh in the comments uh, and go also support the others in the comments who are talking shit about things that you can relate to. I will be deep in the comments replying because I just, I love this for us, I really do. And I feel a little better. So I am about to film a Halloween video for the main channel. So today is the first Halloween video of the season. Um, let me know what kind of Halloween content you guys want to see. It's always just like, I never know quite what to do because like Halloween of 2016 was definitely a moment, but Halloween videos just like look a little different. So anyways, I'm doing an updated version of a video I did last year. Um, just like buying basic bagged Halloween costumes and DIYing them, making them better. I mean, there's a little spoiler for you right there for one of the costumes, but I went to Spirit Halloween, grabbed some stuff. Also, here's your reminder right now, if you wanna just like get a bagged Halloween costume, like a store-bought one, go now before shit starts selling out because there were already like a lot of costumes that were entirely gone in my size. So anyways, uh, Halloween videos start today. Halloween has turned into Holloween, and I guess I'm not gonna film a video in this sweater because literally the best parts, the best parts. I'm so sad about that. God damn, it's like right where the hair lays. Wow. Uh, so I'm going to DIY this so it'll look different uh, within probably the hour and that'll be obviously on the main channel. But what a cute little Buzz Lightyear costume. I was Buzz Lightyear and I think my second or third year of university and I straight up just bought a kid's costume and I think I just chopped it in the middle and the, I, now that I'm thinking about it actually, I think I literally just wore the pants like as Capris almost like it wasn't even that hoey now that I'm thinking back to it I'll put a picture on screen if I can find it. Um, I Realistically probably don't want to share what my eyebrows looked like when I was in university because I already know that it was bad It's the vlog channel and I feel like I feel like we have the relationship like that where you won't cover me for my eyebrows um, So I'll try and find the picture if I can it'll be on screen if I am emotionally ready to share it with the world um, but yeah, here is a uh, one of the first costumes of the DIY Halloween season. Hi guys, good morning, welcome back to the vlog. Oh my God, literally two glams 
in one vlog. I haven't had to do my own hair in like over a week and I don't ever want to go back. I have been so spoiled with the most incredible hair and makeup artists. Um, so Alexis Oakley, she was actually the artist that did my makeup the very last event that I went to pre-COVID um, for the Mulan movie premiere in like February of 2022. So anyways, I am on set with Target today. Traffic passing, traffic passing, large truck, please hold, please hold. I have never looked so glam in a vlog, just like continuously. Um, so today is our last day shooting. Oh God, I'm in like an area with like construction places all around. Okay, bye. So basically all of like the shooting studios are kind of like in the middle of nowhere, like a little bit north of LA. So that's where I am today. Um, and then tonight is the bachelor finale. So headed to Remy's tonight. And like realistically, like I think I mentioned this in the last vlog, like we're on a crumble kick this last month. So I think Mia is grabbing crumble on the way so we can do another quick little taste test. But what I wanted to intro is that we went to the Emmys this week and I have a little bit of footage, mostly footage of getting glammed and Zayn being a highly chaotic mess pre-Emmys. I just realized when I said that I've been double glammed this week, that, that didn't make sense. There's a fucking plane now, Jesus. Just realized that saying that I had double glam would not make sense until you see the clip of me getting glammed for the Emmys. It was so much fun. We did a recap on the podcast, so that's already up if you wanna hear more about um, our Emmys experience. Um, but anyways, I will roll into that and um, I can show you a little bit of the set probably today after and then bachelor finale. Just showed up for the Emmys in the. <laughs> oh yeah, look, he invited me 12 hours before, right? I ran to the, the tuxedo place. Uh -huh. These ladies uh -huh. are quick. They're uh -huh. like, we're gonna get you there, we're gonna get uh -huh. you there. My assistant's leaving there right now. We switched the buttons on everything. They tailored it. They did switch the buttons? Everything in like two <gasps> hours. Unbelievable. And now she's hauling ass to get there by 3.15 so we can just, I'm, I'm down to just leave in this. This woman is a change, race. I'll change in the Uber. I'm fine with that. Why don't you just put your suit on? I'm sorry. <laughs> wow, that's the perfect cup size for you? Yeah, it is, wow. <laughs> this is gorge. Look at the, the bodysuit. That's where your cooch goes. What? There's no pants. That's what do you mean there's no pants? That's, you're not, where, your, that's where your cooch goes. Well, what about, you're not wearing any underwear? No, that's where your cooch goes. What? what? That's where the cooch goes. Oh, because we're in 2022. Girls are showing off all their stuff these Free days. Free the cooch. Free the cooch. Free the cooch. I get it. What if I just wore see-through pants and just my dangling? Just, uh, would that would dangling. that be okay? Wow, you must have a big dick to see <laughs> fucking dangling. Oh, no, no, it, it would not, no. Honestly, it would, it would look tucked, honestly. <laughs> I'm a, I'm a grower, not a shower. That's so good to know. Okay, so I've got two zippers, buttons, and a full corset. I've got struggles and sweat, blood, sweat, and tears that have to go into getting this on. Wish me luck. Dress is on, hair clips are out, shoes are on. I've got moleskin packed in my bag for when uh, I can already feel that right here is going to shed blood later. You bring over the, the news? Chaos. The news. Chaos. Okay. Wow. They did this in two hours. Yeah. In two hours. Dude. Yeah. Okay, I want to give a shout out to this place. They're called Encino Tuxedo and Bridal. <laughs> Unbelievable <laughs> service. They were fucking running that place. And I was the only one there. But there was like five ladies just like, we gotta go. 
Juju. They were work. Tell me they weren't like hustling in there for me. It was insane. Like I was Brad Pitt or something. Just kidding. But I'm just Lil Zayn Hijazi. Yeah. Lil, Lil, Lil Zayn Hijazi. They were treating me like a fucking celebrity in there. Also, it was unbelievable. I just point the camera at you and you literally just start talking. Yeah, yeah, it's right. insane. It was, it was like a two second it's thing. It's insane. He goes, you just, I had to even say anything. You just like started talking. And I'm also like, like to Encino suit. To Encino bright on tuxedo. Woo! Mm. I was stressed out the entire time. <laughs> Sassy. Thinking I was gonna be late, but guess what? Right when I'm pulling up in the car, I see Zane carrying his suit walking in, and I was like, yeah. Well, at least I'm not that late or unprepared. What is that? Yes. <laughs> wow. I hated that. No, your pocket square. It's it's <gasps> it's it, it, no no. Wait, okay, your pocket square is here. Zane's gonna like bust a move in the I butt. <laughs> <laughs> Remember how clean these shoes are. Oh, yeah, no, 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 no. Nice. The nice, these will be a Oh, absolutely. These are nice. I think the white shoes were good. I think so, too. Okay. I think so, too. Good detail. Thank you, guys. And, like, the little blue on the bottom. Yeah, blue, it's almost like blue, blue it was gummy? put together by a stylist. <laughs> wow. Okay, we've got a whole living room built out for this. So welcome to my living room. We've also got a whole closet over here. This is movie magic, basically. Whole closet. You're not looking at my camera. Wild, wild, wild. And also like, look at these fake windows. This is so funny. Actually, I think this bush back here might actually be real. Yeah, that definitely looks real. But it's like outside of this fake window. I've got my front door. Welcome to my crib, LOL. Also imagine me with this like decor. <laughs> So mature. Not quite the same equipment as the vlog camera, <laughs> but here's, here's the little bedroom that we have staged. This actually would be such a cute studio apartment. Like you had all this space. This is definitely not my first apartment. Looks like not even close, but here's a little bedroom that we are staging to do some content. Very cute. This is what a double bed size is. This is really small. Jeremy and I would not fit into this bed. Not even close. Oh my god, here's the overview shot of this entire warehouse that we're shooting with today. The lighting's kind of ass, but like here is the whole fake living room area. You can see all of the lights and like the lighting rings up top. This is all over here, like extra furniture and props and stuff. That little huddle people is where they like see the main screen. But yeah, massive fucking space today. Hose and grumble! Hose. Oh my god, and the new Sorry, hose and cow. Oh. Hose and cow. <laughs> yeah, I know it's the crumble cookie cutter. <laughs> wow. Wow. They're making bank. Not only are you buying cookies, you're buying cookie yeah, you're cookies. Yeah, you're buying the cookie accessories. Mm -hmm. Cookie accessories. Okay, we've got strawberry milk this week. We've got peanut butter, fucking nutter butter. What is this? A peanut? What's this? Yeah, uh, muddy buddy. M muddy buddy. Um, pink sugar cookie Cadillac something. They put a car on it. <laughs> they put a car on it. And then this one's cake batter. I just need you to see the height. That this cookie, big. this thing is fucking. Later. later. This thing this is, is like. You got spoiled, Rem. Look at this thing. You already got the look at this thing. This bitch you got better? bad spoilers. I'm not gonna say anything. I haven't said anything. Oh, oh my god. Oh my god. Are you okay? <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. I didn't even think you would cut into eight. I like how we cut, yeah, into like oh. 16. <laughs> Fuck. I know I'm so excited for strawberry milk. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go for it. <laughs> you want one? Now? So good. Is it good? Is it so good? Hold on, I need more peace. <laughs> so sorry. It's really good. It's really good. Mm -hmm. Oh god, wow, it's really good. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Also, wow, the glow down from my last vlog clip of being on set to now <laughs> to having holographic pimple stickers on my head. Wow. Also, in our last crumble taste test, mm -hmm. some of the comments were like, "Wow, watching you guys try that was like watching two brain cells slap together." As you're just like. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, mean. Oh. There's white chocolate chips in it or something. Yeah, there's white chocolate. Mm -hmm. Oh. Yeah. Fuck mm -hmm. me up. Mm -hmm. Sorry. Is the pink Cadillac the normal one? I think so. 
Mm. They just put a car in it. Yeah. Mm. Ma'am, reach across. Oh, Go for it. Go for sorry, it. Sorry, <laughs> vlog. <laughs> oh. Oh. Wait, wait, will look you at show? that dough. I love when it's fucking not I cooked love... in the middle. Oh. I want it to be melted like Give me this. that salmonella, baby. That doesn't look cooked, actually. It's not at all. Oh, wow. It's warm. So warm. It's literally warm now. Mm. You're gonna, gonna die. Gonna yeah. Let me just put this piece back on. It's literally not cooked. <laughs> That's my favorite We're gonna get sick. Don't act like you've never had Can raw cookie dough. I do. I'm gonna shit. I'm so excited. You're gonna like this one the most. No, this is literally... The, it's still sweating on the I inside. Think this was my favorite I've ever had. It's definitely not this cooked. Really good. I'm scared now. It's good. It will be fine, but you're gonna love it. This one's bomb. Which was that one? Yeah. Oh, cake batter. Yeah, mm -hmm. it's like cake. They literally cooked it for maybe a minute. My God. I don't think I can describe how uncooked this is. Mm. So, in the best way, though, right? And <coughs> the frosting is way better today than usual. Don't you agree? Yeah, it's like lighter, right? It's like. You know what it is. What? They put them on hot cookies so it started to melt. Oh, you're oh. so mm. right. This, there's no crunch. It's, it's just not, melty. Yeah, it's not like thick and oh. sugary. Mm. I like it much more. Mm. I've never like had a set of crumble store. Oh, cool. oh my god. What is it god. like? Like you It looks like these? a dentist office. It literally you looks like a dentist office. You can, you oh can my god. This channel is just a crumble office? taste test channel from now on. That's me with my, my TikTok. This piece is good. Of course, it's a hot piece. Mm. Wow, this one. Okay, yeah, that's a finale. It's really good, but ten out of ten. Wow. Oh I my god, so I've got my too. Momo, Miss Remy Ashton squish. I've got my single serving alcohol. <laughs> what a great day. Oh my god. So set was long. I was there for twelve hours, um, but it's time to watch the batch. With the hose, Cal and Momo. <laughs> Momo, come here. Momo, Hi. Momo, 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 come here. Yes, 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 yes. Momo. <laughs> 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 Okay, okay, I'm gonna end the vlog. Hope you guys Momo. enjoyed it. Personal space, Momo. Thank you. What is personal space? We don't know her. Momo's personal space. Hope you guys enjoyed it, and I will see you in the next one. Bye, guys.